Hello and welcome to this latest Lucosa Retro Game Review video and for this one uh, we have chosen, well I could wait to, for it to come up on screen but it seems to take a while here we go it is Parallax from Ocean um, with a uh, title screen that absolutely does my head in so I'm going to jump straight into the game and uh, try my best to explain this one because this is a, a bit of a complicated one right now we start off in the ship there but we're not actually going to take off anywhere yet we're about to load the standard kit um, so that we can leave the ship and now exit it and off we go we want to head into here which is the hangar and there is an alien scientist who hopefully yeah we stunned him we'll take his card um, right we don't want to use that yet I don't think we want to use this yet either no right so we are going to take him out of here back to the ship. Right, now we can lift off and we are now trying to find another of those hangers which hopefully has yeah, the hangar there as it would help if I actually oh, landed Right, landing gear is down, so, right, here we go. Alright, let's uh, get the standard kit. I'm going to bring one of the scientists with me. Uh, scientists won't come with me. It's because I don't have any drugs in order to take him, so, okay, we'll try this without him. <sighs> won't let me... Uh, leave without him. So I've got to get some drugs from somewhere. <clears throat> How many times has uh, that been uh, said? So, um, the idea of the game. Um, basically you're trapped inside this huge computer complex and you've, well not computer complex, it's uh, like an alien, um, well, some alien built uh, area and they seem friendly at first but uh, they are in fact uh, planning some kind of invasion now, in order to uh, prevent it you have to um, locate the four other friendly uh, scientists who have also uh, uh, in the uh, in this complex And in order to find our way, right, let's make a note of that. So the third letter of the password, there are it's either four or five, I think it's four. Uh, to find. And once you have the password you can then leave the uh, particular section of um, the complex that you are in. <sighs> you with me so far? Uh, yeah. Now in order to uh, leave that area you have to have all four letters of the password which will then uh, grant you access to the next uh, section where the next scientist that uh, you need to get out of uh, here is found. And if I'm, I'm a bit engrossed in uh, all of this actually, so I'm not doing a very good job of explaining the game at all. 
this part of the game where you're going around shooting at uh, the aliens and that is, as you can see, it's not that well done. And it's rather basic. It's uh, shooting the, you know, whoops, I didn't want to do that. Stay aboard. Um, shooting the actual ground-based targets is quite simple. I thought for a minute I was going to be destroyed there because that looked like I'm heading to uh, another part of the complex, but in fact I'm still in the uh, first part. Let's get ourselves closer to, oops, to uh, the hangar and see what we can get from here. Aha, another scientist. That's handy. What card does he have? 2350. I'll take that. Insert that card. So, second letter is T. Card's been taken back. I think this is uh, oh, it's a computer shop. I need to go to the bank first and, uh, <laughs> same old story, got to go to the bank first to draw money out. Nothing changes, does it? Even in the midst of uh, alien invasion, you still need to go to the bank to get your money. Right, well, we can land here. Oh, okay, yeah, we'll take this. Here we go. Nothing here apart from the uh, robot guard, so that was a bit of a waste. So anyway, um, yes, while you're actually flying around in the ship and trying and failing to shoot at anything that's, you know, moving, although shooting the uh, ground plate targets is uh, usually easy enough. But you, in order to actually progress in the game, that's where you have to exit the ship and uh, find the uh, various scientists that are uh, scattered around throughout the complex. Now this looks like a very long landing pad that leads to nowhere, but there are a, a whole selection of... Uh, I don't seem to be able to land. There must be a problem with my landing gear. That's going to be a bit of an issue. Ah, here we go, landing gear's down. Now let's see if we can uh, head to this one. And, uh, there's nothing in here either. It's another bloody sentry robot. Okay, back we go. Damn it, the uh, landing gear's been damaged again. I need to land back in that area so that I can explore all these hangars. There's so many of them. Uh oh, alright. Uh, I've never had this happen before. I seem to have landed, but. Right, here we go. Get out. Oh, right, another scientist. Let's get this bastard. Okay, card starts with a zero. That means it's not going to give me anything in terms of, uh, if I can use it here. Okay, so we'll put his card in. Ask for the number. All you need to put in is the number that's showing in the, uh, bottom there. The trouble is, with that flash, I can't tell if it's 255 or 256. Let's try 255. Okay, right. It's not 255. So, it must be 256 then. There it is. Right. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I 
I have got some credits, I think. Let's buy the bombs a pack and hope that it's, uh... Okay, so I do have the drugs, so all I need now is to f find those last two uh, letters of the password for one and four, and then I can uh, go to the next uh, section of the... Uh I didn't manage to get out of the first level. I could do with being reminded of what the bloody password is, so I could have gone a bit further. Um, right, so, well, I'll get to put my name in. But So that's uh, Parallax, which I did a, a atrocious job of, uh, uh, right, hang on, I'm going to have to start a game just so I can do my summing up, because that flashing screen is too much. And, and while no one will agree with me, I think the uh, Martin Galway uh, music uh, for the uh, title screen is shit. Um, Anyway, I've done a dreadful job of, uh... Mm -hmm. ...of explaining what to do in the game. Um, so, I, if anybody uh, wants to know, I'll uh, write um, a better sort of explanation as to what to do in the um, uh, description. <coughs> But um, it is one of those games that, uh, to a degree, it's a shoot 'em up. But there is so much more to it than that, and it's it's almost like a shoot 'em up come adventure uh, type game, which um, I think is a great combination. It's it's certainly uh, much more interesting to play than your standard shoot 'em up, and um, like so many of uh, Ocean's original games, if they when they don't bother with uh, things like, you know, official license, you know, television or film tie-ins, and even when they don't bother with arcade conversions, more often than not, they will end up releasing excellent games. This is one of them. Or, you know, you look at Whizball as uh, another. Or Frankie Goes to Hollywood. Uh, that's a fantastic game. Um, it's only when they then go into the uh, um, official license uh, stuff and they make crap like, you know, Knight Rider and Miami Vice and Highlander and, and all that shit. And it it ruins their reputation um, because for every decent game they brought out, they brought out a game that was just utter bollocks. Um, but thankfully this is uh, one of their really good ones. Um, 
and if I'd done a better job of explaining it and showing how to play it, um, you might have agreed, but yeah, this video hasn't turned out to be one of my better ones. So what I may do sometime in the future is revisit this one and um, uh, re-review it, um, showing you more of what to do and uh, giving a better explanation. For now though, the rating, um, I think it's fantastic. Um, I would give this, mm, I'd give it eight and a half out of ten. It's not quite good enough for the nines, but um, it's still an excellent game. So yeah, eight and a half out of ten. I think that's a pretty good reflection. And um, yeah, so. <laughs> Um, that is Parallax. 8.5 out of 10. Um, I'll almost certainly, as I say, uh, come back to this one and do another video of it with a better explanation and uh, you know, a better uh, showing of uh, gameplay. Cause I don't, well, I didn't do it justice at all in this one. So, uh, yeah, that brings this uh, video uh, to an end. We shall see you at the next one.